All right. Hello, friends, and welcome to a new series on my channel. If you're new here, my name is Kit. I am non-binary, so I use they, them pronouns. I recently played Undertale, and some of you guys said that next I should play Delta Rune. Before we begin this, I just want to say that I don't really know anything about this game. Um, I do know that it's kind of a companion to Undertale. I don't know any of the character names, but I do know how some of them look like. Like, this is a blank slate, I have no idea. And I do know that this game is currently in demo only. Only chapter 1 and 2 are currently available. So, we're gonna hop in, I guess, and just start playing. I gotta figure out the controls, okay, like this. That's apparently not correct. How about enter? Yes, okay. And then my screen went kind of down more. Am I? There? No. Are we? Connected? Yes. Okay. Excellent. Truly. Excellent. Well, now I'm scared. The excellent itself was fine, but the truly? Now. We may begin. All right. First. You must create a vessel. Okay. Select the head that you prefer. Oh! Character creation? Also, I forgot that I can... Uh, it's F4 for full screen? Yes. Hold on, let me change that over here. Teehee, here I am being silly and not having the game in full screen. Um, oh! There are options. Wow. Okay, what head do I prefer? I'm not really sure what's going on with like the bottom section here. This is like a hair strand, perhaps. Swoopy bangs. That one has a scar. I didn't know there was going to be character creation, okay? I'm between these two. I guess let's go this? Select the torso. I see no different. Oh, uh, long sleeves versus short sleeves versus longer sleeves. That's cute. I kind of like that one. Is that weird? Select the legs. Yep, those are legs. Those are also legs. I'm not seeing a difference, besides this one is opposite of all the rest of these. This is your body. Cool. Do you accept it? Yeah. Excellent. You have created a wonderful form, <laughs> thank you. Now, let us shape its mind as your own, okay? What is its favorite food? <laughs> Pain? Um, I love a good salt. I like salt. <laughs> your favorite blood type? <laughs> what? Um, I don't know. I don't know anything about blood types. I don't even know my own blood type. <laughs> the a, a, B. What color does it like most? Red, blue, green, or cyan? Hmm. 
red, blue, green, or cyan? I honestly don't know. <laughs> um, maybe, maybe red. Well, let's go blue. Please give it a gift. Ooh, ooh, kindness, mind, ambition, bravery, or voice. These are... A lot of these are really good gifts. I'm between kindness and mind. Mind, perhaps. How do you feel about your creation? It will not hear. Oh. I love it. Have you answered honestly? Yes. You acknowledge the possibility of pain and seizure. <laughs> I guess. Understood. Name your vessel. Oh, okay. Well, as we all know, um, this is me, so... That's me. Is it really going to be me, though? Or <laughs> we called it Kit. And what about the creator? Oh, my name's Kit. <laughs> so... <laughs> Congratulations, we're both Kit. Kit. <laughs> is that bad? To, to name it after me? Of course, of course, of course. They are the same. Okay. It even acknowledges when it's the same name. Thank you for your time. Your answers... Your wonderful... Creation. Will now be discarded. Thanks. No one can choose who they are in this world. My name is <laughs> Chris. What the fuck? <laughs> what was that? Okay. Chris, if you do not wake up, we will be late for school. <gasps> oh no, not school. I will wait outside for you, all right? Okay. That was so bizarre. That was such a bizarre opening. Can I look at anything? The drawer is mostly empty except for a school cross county shirt with a tear in it. Okay. Closed drawer. Uh huh. What is this? It's a red wagon with a rusty bird cage in it. Why? Looks like it's seen quite a few crashes. Why the birdcage? Also, whoever shares my room is, uh... Has a lot of trophies. There are CDs under the bed. Classical, jazz, religious, ska. There's also a game console. It has one normal controller and one knockoff one. <laughs> yeah, okay. Computer? There are many boxes under it filled with old books. Okay. I mean, the two sides of the room are... Alright. Let me see if I can change my controls, because I don't like this. Okay, it says that I can only change the controls once I get later into the game. However, I do remember now the uh, ZXC thing, so... Let's go! There are many books! You're right! Tales of Snails, a <laughs> storybook. Snails do not have tails, a scientific refutation. Can snails help your garden? Um, not really. An assigned copy of the History of Humans and Monsters by Gerson Boom. Okay. A cactus. There's not much to say about it. There are crayons in the drawer. Their labels have long faded and there's no green. <laughs> okay. That's me! It's only you. Oh, okay. The door is locked. Okay. I'm very interested in seeing- Listen, I'm not going to make any assumptions as of yet, but I'm very interested in seeing 
where all this goes. Interesting. There's a photo on the fridge. It's of you, your mother, and your brother. I have a brother! Okay. There's some white fur stuck in the drain. There's some cinnamon batter caked on the stove top. Cookie cutters for gingerbread monsters and gingerbread humans. That's cute. Trash can. It's emitting a pleasant floral scent. Okay. Nice. I like the way that the art has evolved. By the way, um, there's like dimension in this. A landline, but you already have a cell phone. <laughs> All right, well. Uh, it's Cheriel, the beloved living room chair. I see. This one's not Cheriel. This one's just a chair. The TV doesn't seem to even be plugged in anymore. Okay. Couch? Book of hymns. Which one do you think is the front door? I assume that one. So let's go this way. Oh, the bathroom! There's a can of Icy's Cool cool Boys Body Spray. Spray for the boys. Flamin' Hot Pizza flavor. It seems to be almost entirely full. I wonder why. It's a toilet. Flush it? No. It's good to conserve water. You're so right. On the shower ledge, there's a small container of apple-scented shampoo. And a gallon-sized container of pet shampoo. That's funny. <laughs> that, that, one's, that one got me to giggle, alright? Let's head out. I like that little heart thing up there, okay? Chris, there you are. We might still be able to make it. Chris, it's a beautiful day today, is it not? I hope it stays this way when Azrael visits next week. Okay. But I wonder, after the excitement of university, will he still enjoy coming home to this little town? Yes, I would think so. What the hell is this? I'm obsessed. Oh my god. Okay, there's the library. I looked at it this time. Okay. Oh! Of course, it's very important to hold my hand as we walk into school. Another hug. Very good. And I'm off. To the races. Damn. So, does everyone have a... Sorry, I'm late. Oh, Chris, we thought you weren't coming today. We're doing group projects this month. For the whole month. So, walk around and find a partner, okay? Legitimately? Chris? Our Versars. Tem already have partner. Is that your partner? What is that? It's a black and white hard-boiled egg. Sadly, it seems like it already has a partner. <laughs> Alright. Yo, Chris, show up earlier next time. Are you the kid, but like, older? I ended up having to partner with Snowy. <laughs> now he keeps turning to me and saying howdy, partner, like a cowboy. I love them. Partner? I hardly know her. <laughs> what do you think of that one? Funny, right? Yeah. No? Well, I got news for you, pal. I already got a partner. Scram. Damn. Okay. I have a feeling I know who I'm supposed to talk to, so... Ah, Chris. Late again, I see. Hmm? You need a partner? Sorry, I'm already partners with the second smartest student. Though, wait. Chris, now that I think about it, your unique skill set might help a lot on this assignment. Not. I actually want to get an A. Damn, okay. <laughs> Chris, I like the way he moves. You know Jockington and Caddy are always partners. We're the ultimate academic duo ever since our first gym class. It was hula hoop day and they ran out of hoops for us. So she used me instead. That's our origin story. 
Click, click, tap, tap. Taken. <laughs> what? What am I watching on my phone? It's schoolwork, of course. Uh, animated schoolwork. And... Hey, Chris, have you chosen a partner yet? No. <laughs> I talk I haven't talked to the one person I need to. Hey, Chris, what's up? Did you lose your pencil again? Here, you want the candy cane one or the one with lights on it? The lights. Huh? You want to be partners? Um, sorry. Damn! Birdly already asked me. But I could ask Miss Alphys if we could make a group of three. I'll ask if you're sure. Yeah. Okay, I'll ask. Miss Alphys, um, is it okay if we have a group of three? Hey, what? No, I do not approve of this. Abort! What? But, but Chris doesn't have a... Noelle, what were you saying? She was just saying we're fine being alone. Actually, I just wanted to know if... Noelle, can you please speak up? Damn. Oh, shit. Hi, Susie. <laughs> Alphys, can you please speak up? <laughs> Am I late? A little. Oh, no, you're fine. We were just, uh, ch choosing partners for the next group project, and, um, Susie, you're with Chris. Great. Now that I love that face that Elvis makes. <laughs> now that everyone's here, I'll write the assignment. Uh, has anyone seen the chalk? This is the third time it's gone missing, and y you all know I can't start class without some. How about this? If no one speaks up, Everyone gets in trouble. You can't use corporal punishment on a group of kids. Uh, anyone? P please? Hey, there might be a box in the supply closet. Miss Alphys, why don't Susie and I... Good idea, Noel. Susie, since you came in last, why don't you go get it for me? Whatever. And C Chris, can you go with her and make sure she, um, actually gets it and, um, stays out of trouble? Thanks, Chris. See you later. Okay. Am I allowed to read these? Motivational quotes from various literature. All right. Try your best, Astral Wolf. Even in your darkest hour. That one seems to be from a video game. Cool. Can I read these? No? Okay. Hey. Chris. Didn't see you there. Hey. You didn't see anything just now, did you? Huh. You can't even say? Chris. Oh my god, what are we? <laughs> hey. Let me tell you a secret. Shit. <laughs> Quiet people piss me off. Damn. You think just because you don't say anything, I can't tell exactly what you're thinking? It's over. I caught Su Su Susie. I wish I could talk. Eating all the chalk. This was her last chance. Now she'll finally be expelled. <laughs> Come on, Chris. Don't act shocked. You know it's true. Everyone's waiting for it. Everyone wants it. So congrats, Chris. You got me. I'm done for. Just let me say one little thing. Seems like a waste to get expelled just for having a snack. So Chris, if I know you're gonna pull the trigger... <laughs> what? 
Why don't I just get expelled for some real carnage? Chris, how do you feel? About losing your face. I enjoy having a face. I don't think you're gonna do it. Nah. Chris, you've got a good mother. Thank you. It'd be a shame to make her bury her child. <laughs> yeah, that would be a real shame. <laughs> Alright, let's get this over with. We'll get more chalk, Mosey back to class. And then, Chris. You'll do our project. How's that sound? Good. Don't bother answering, okay? If you haven't gotten it by now, your choices don't matter. <laughs> <laughs> no, I feel that. Yeah. Let's go, freak. Damn. Shit. Am I allowed to look at the lockers, actually? No? The locker is locked. Huh. The locker's lock is locked. Huh. The lock's locker is locked. Hmm. The locker's lock's locker is locked. The locker is covered in Jockington memorabilia. I didn't know he had fans. Are you ready for the Sadie Hawkman's dance? No. At this dance, all the chaperones wear giant hawk heads. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> and screech at any students that make contact while dancing. So, like, a normal dance. Can I check out the water fountain first? What, realize the baby classroom was a better fit for you? Hey, actually, I should come with you. Maybe I'll find a better partner in there. No, actually, let's not. I just wanted to check out the water fountain. You drank from the water fountain. Damn, okay. People put their mouth on that, you know? Yeah. <sighs> I want to go that way. Wrong way, Chris. Fine. God, can you walk any slower or what? Nah, I get it. Not used to walking around without someone holding your hand. Come on, freak. I'm getting bullied. <laughs> you guys wanted me to play this game so I could be bullied? Well, here's the closet. Too bad. You can't find the exit? We were just starting to have fun. What the hell goes on in that closet? <laughs> Hey, Chris, is it me, or... Is it really dark in there? What's the holdup, Chris? Are you gonna go in, or what? Fine, if you're gonna be a wimp, then I'll... Go ahead. We'll both go in at the same time. <laughs> okay. <laughs> See? Why are you so scared? There's nothing in here but old papers. Let's try to find a light switch. That's weird. I can't find a switch. Guess it's further in. Oh, I doubt it. Uh, kind of big for a closet, huh? You'd think we'd have reached the end by now. Hey, Chris. I think this closet's, uh, broken. <laughs> there aren't any walls. Well, we've worked hard enough. If Alphys wants chalk so bad, she can just get it herself. Let's split. I felt that. What the? Hey, this isn't funny. Let us out. Let us... The floor, it's... That's cool. That was a cool animation. Also, what the hell? We're dead. Nothing else is appearing on screen. Oh, just kidding, here I am. Okay. I'm blue.
Okay, well, anyway, moving on. Hmm, safe spot. At times, you see it flickering, the light only you can see. By second nature, you reach out and... Save. Okay. That would be interesting if I could get to it. I don't like that this wall is crying. It's too dark to see anything. That was something up there that just moved. Hello. You sleeping, bud? Oh, many sleepers. Um, that's looking at me. Anyway, going this way, um, certainly there's nothing dangerous down here. Stick your hand in it. There's something glowing inside. Take it? You got the glow shard. The heck is that? Oh, even the menu's different. Ooh, config. Ooh. Anyway, as we were saying, um, item. I just want to look at it. E? Its use is unknown. Of course, of course. You're so right. This is a mistake. I don't know what that is. I don't want it to wake up. But also... Very important to me that both of those were swinging. Yikes. I'm scared. I'm gonna go back and save and then I'll be back. Just kidding. Terrible news. I cannot go back. <laughs> There is no save from this point on, so hopefully I continue to keep that glow shard. Going back here for the third time now. The fuck? You just attacked me. Why did everything change colors? Dar heck? You bathe your body in the light. The power shines within you, breaking through the darkness. Any pain you have may have... Your HP was restored. I puzzle. Fun. In this land, only eyes blinded by darkness can see the way. Cool. I see. And why didn't you turn on? How bizarre. Oh, I see. I see. That's what those things underneath it means. You know what? I solved the puzzle, and now I understand how to solve the puzzle. Okay. Moving on. Hello?
on the corner of my screen. Something continuously on the corner of my screen. Uh, hi. I squeeze past you, please. Can I, can I squeeze past? I squeeze. Excuse me. <laughs> hey, but back off. Come any closer and I'll... Chris? Phew. Hey, don't scare me like that, dumbass. Unless you want to get clocked in the face. <laughs> anyway, enough screwing around. We gotta find a way out of here. Mm-hmm. Um, where is here, anyway? Doesn't matter. You got us into this mess, you get us out. Lead the way, Chris. Yeah, sure. Can we talk? No? Aww, we hug. <laughs> oh my god, never mind, you walk way too slow. I like Chris turning to the camera. Very important to me, okay? Oh, interesting. What's that over there? Hello? Rocks? Hey, Chris, there's someone up there waving at us. Oh, hello! Any idea what they want? To say hi. That's death. Run, Chris. Also, that was not a wave hi, that was- Hey, guys! Ah! Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> I'm safe. <laughs> so long as I don't don't go sometimes. Uh I'm safe. Chris, down here. We uh... I can't move. There's no Oh I can move. Oh no. <laughs> Doesn't make any sense. Let me leave. Okay, okay. Yeah, that was scary. Oh, rough landing. Fish, what the hell? Uh... Hey. Oh, you're not dead. Sweet. Got any idea what the heck this place is? No. Me neither. Wonder if there's anyone in that building up there. I want to go this way first. I cannot. You're in the way. Okay. I'll... I'll walk up to the build... Which one? Items? Uh, sword. In? Question mark. The door is locked and no one's inside. Okay. Locked? It's also locked. It's locked. In front of you, a castle looms beneath the empty town. A black geyser emerges from it, piercing endlessly into the sky. The power of this place shines within you. Okay. A castle? Why the hell is there a castle inside a supply closet? Welcome, heroes. Who's there? Do not be alarmed. I am not your enemy. Please, come forward, both of you. Hey. Welcome. I am the prince of this kingdom. The kingdom of darkness, okay? Chris, Susie. There is a legend in this land. A legend that one day, two heroes of light <laughs> will arrive, okay? And fulfill the ancient prophecy foretold by time and space. Please, heroes, listen to my tale. Sure. Very well, then. Once upon a time, a legend was whispered among shadows. 
It was a legend of hope. It was a legend of dreams. It was a legend of light. It was a legend of dark. This is the legend of Deltarune. For millennia, for millennia, light and dark have lived in balance, bringing peace to the world. But if this harmony were to shatter, a terrible calamity would occur. The sky will run black with terror, and the land will crack with fear. Then, her heart pounding, Lance? The earth will draw her final breath. Okay. Only then, shining with hope. Three heroes appear at world's edge. Well, we're two. A human. Uh-huh. A monster. Uh-huh. And a prince from the dark. How right, nice to meet you. Only they can seal the fountains. Okay and banish the angel's heaven. Only then will balance be restored and the world saved from destruction. Today, the fountain of darkness, the geyser that gives this land form, stands tall at the center of the kingdom. But recently, another fountain has appeared on the horizon. And with it, the balance of light and dark begins to shift. Okay. Chris, Susie, thank you for listening to my long tale. I deeply believe you two are the heroes of the legend. That despite whatever enemies you may face, you two have the courage to save the world. Delta warriors, please, won't you accept your destiny? Uh, no. Nah. <laughs> what? Me? Some kind of hero or something? You've got the wrong person. B but Susie, without you, the, the world will... So what? If the world gets destroyed, it's none of my damn business. Might even be kind of fun, honestly. Anyway, Chris, if you want to play pretend with this weirdo, stick around. I'm going to find a way out of here. Susie, wait! Ho ho ho, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas? The heroes are already running away. And they didn't even know I was here. My dad's gonna make me son of the month. <laughs> Damn, okay. Who the hell are you? I'm... The bad guy. <laughs> You clowns want to seal our dark fountain, huh? And, still picturing you guys as clowns, save the world from eternal darkness, huh? Eh. Don't try to deny it. We both know you'll go east. It's your only way home. But I, Lancer, won't let you go there. And I've got a flawless two-step plan to ensure it. Alright, let's hear it. Step one, I thrash you. Step two, you lose. Huh. Nice plan, kid. Really? Yeah, actually. Mind if we use it on you instead? Okay. Um. So, I mean, <laughs> if it's Undertale adjacent. <laughs> How do I get into this fight? How do I get out of this fight without fighting? Right? Lancer, you are such a good kid. Your dad is probably so proud of you. Honestly, I don't even know why he has Kid of the Month when he should just have you. Like, am I right? 
Yeah, that's about what compliment means. You can't tell the difference between his clothes and his body. Is that a compliment, Chris? He seems flattered. His attack power went down. Susie. <laughs> oh, you make my feelings I didn't read. Oh, shit. Don't know how I got an axe, but like, that's cool. Um... His name wasn't yellow. Yeah, I mean... I love to get thrashed. Just kidding, that's you. Shit. Is there a way to get out of this? Yo, man. Listen. <laughs> Susie ain't playing around. Watch out for Susie's attack. He readies himself. Chris! So what are you guys doing after this? <laughs> what does that mean? Spencer's riding it out, yeah. Um... I don't know what to do in this situation. You want another compliment? You want another warning? He laughs at the idea he would need your help. Ho ho ho, I'm the bad guy. Merry Christmas. Yet again. I'm getting better. Wait, wait a second. My bike's running out of fuel. Oh, okay. Alright, you punk of ruse. Okay, I kinda like it. You had the luck of the draw this time, but next time, the losers will be you. Ha ha ha. Bye, losers. I gotta get home before dinner. You won. I got $35. Are you two okay? No <laughs> thanks to you. Um, allow me to introduce myself more properly. I am. <gasps> Jeez, can you take off that hood? I can barely hear you under there. Um, all right. Hello, everyone. I'm Raoul Say. Chris, Susie, it's ever so wonderful to meet you. I'm certain we're going to become great friends, and... Best way to leave is east, right? Yes, that's where we'll... Got it. See you at school, Chris. Um, I suppose it's just the two of us, then. Alright. Chris, I'm a prince, but... I, um, currently don't have any subjects. I've been waiting alone here. Um, my whole life for the two of you to arrive. So, I'm really happy to meet you. I hope we can be good friends, Chris. Me too. Let's try to find Susie. She must be to the southeast. You can lead the way, Chris. Alright? Can I chat? Do you want a hug? Yay! Okay. Can I... Hey, Chris, I really think we should catch up with Susie. We can come back here after our adventure is over. And then I can bake you a yummy cake! Oh my god, say less. Alright, we gotta do an adventure. I'm excited. Ral say the lonely prince is now your ally. Uh huh. The flower of fluffy boys shines within you. Heck yeah! Oh, I already really like this game. <laughs> Am I allowed to look at these now? It looks like a shop, but the door is locked and no one's inside. Okay. We'll just. Uh, Chris, you know you can hold Q to run? Like, is that the normal button, or...? Really? <laughs> right? You'll move faster by holding Q. And I'll be right behind you, so don't worry. Unless you want to get away, in which case, sorry. Let me try it out! 
I guess. It's a little bit faster. Okay. I like to walk. Alright, where's Susie? Oh, Chris, it's the training dummy I made. Why'd you make it look like you? Now seems like a great chance to prepare for the enemy. Would you like me to teach you how to fight? Sure. Okay, get ready, Chris. See the heart? Yep. That's your soul, the culmination of your being. Within, it holds your will, your compassion, and the fate of the world. If it gets hit, you and your friends will lose HP. If everyone's HP reaches zero, we'll lose the battle. So please, take care to avoid the enemy's attack. Ready? Let's try dodging. Got it. I like that it teaches you this now. <laughs> Great job, Chris. You're a natural. Anyhow, after the enemy attacks, it's our turn, Chris. First, I'll teach you how to fight. Though fighting is unnecessary in this world, there's no harm in a thorough lesson. Let's try fighting. Chris? Um, I don't think, um, this is what you're supposed to be doing. But... This is the best game ever. Huh? Chris, you'd rather hug it out than fight? You know what? That's fine. We don't need to fight. Okay, next let's try defending. Simply shield. And the enemy's attack will hurt you less. Not only that, but you'll also gather TP. Uh huh. Toilet paper. Watch the orange big bar on the left. I'll explain it next. I could spare, but I want to see what this is. Great job! Now that you've gathered TP, how about spending that TP on one of my spells? Okay. If you had, um, hit the enemy, it'd be tired now. In that case, we use my pacify spell on it. It'll fall asleep and we'll win peacefully. Okay. Let's try spells. Okay, but it's only if it's tired, but it's not currently tired, right? You ally. Interesting. Oh, it is tired. Okay. Great, Chris. We would have won the battle by now. Now I have just a little more to teach you. Remember when you hugged the dummy by pressing ACT on it? Because of that, its name turned yellow. Now by using the spare command, you can win. Great job, Chris. That's... that'd be the end in a real battle. I'm really happy I had the chance to teach you, Chris. Yay! Oh, that was fun. You're a wonderful student, Chris. And, uh, in case you ever need a refresher, I... Here, I wrote a manual for you and Susie. Press I to open the menu. I like that it's, um, telling you what buttons I put into the game. <laughs> yes, I is my menu button. Thank you. You got the manual. Q is my back. I'm using Vazd and then E is, like, activate? I'm using Skyrim controls. <laughs> it's just so easy! Okay. Door? Oh my, the great door is opened? No wonder Lancer was able to come through. Chris, once we pass through this door, our adventure will really begin. A journey foretold exactly by the prophecy. But Chris, I believe your choices are important too. This world is full of all kinds of people, Chris. In the end, how we treat them makes all the difference. So let's try our best to get by without fighting. I agree! If we can manage to do that, I believe this tale may have a happy ending. Otherwise, I fear that you may not find the result favorable. Oh, I'm sorry. Is that too much to ask? I can handle it. 
Chris, I knew you were a hero the moment I saw you. Let's try our best, alright? I like him a lot. <laughs> okay. Oh, I just went through the door wrong. You gonna close it? Damn, shit. Why'd you slam? Okay. Interesting. With the door closed behind you, your adventure will truly begin. The power of adventure shines within you. Okay. I guess we can go a little bit more. We have like 10 minutes, so... <laughs> Sounds like somebody's sleeping. The field of hopes and dreams. Oh, okay. Enemies ahead. You're gonna die. Signed, the Lancer. Thank you. Hey. Okay. Ooh. Rudin. You're kind of fast. Convince? Hey! Don't kill me? You... Um... You don't have the power to talk to people. You, you're just kind of here. Defend, perhaps. That might be nice. <laughs> you put your cape around you. You told Rudin to quit fighting. It was utterly swayed. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. <laughs> you're so right. What the hell? Okay. Rudin dislikes its boss, but doesn't care enough to quit. Well, I told you to, so... Yikes. Hey. Can I use your magic outside of battle? That's not the button. I can? No. I can't use your power outside of battle. That's okay. Continuing on. If this sign asks me if I'm dead. If you're reading this, I guess you're dead. Hey, bud. Hey, don't read this sign. It's a work in progress. How are you? It isn't my two favorite people. Psych, you guys aren't even in my top five. Lancer, where's Susie? You mean the purple girl? Ho oh, oh, ho oh. ho. You fools, you're too late to stop me. What did you do? <laughs> it was just so simple. She beat me up, so I ran away. That's a bit anticlimactic. Okay. I assume she continues east, so we'll go south. What the heck is that? These types of trees don't contain an item that can heal you. Oh, okay. Whatever you do, don't check the tree and use I to open your menu. You got it? Okay. There are two objects hanging from the tree. Take one? Yes. You got the dark candy. Oh, okay. I don't think I need it right now, but... Good to know that that won't heal me. I will, in fact, die from eating that. Hey, if you head that way, my troops will thrash you. Is that a threat? I prefer to think of it as an invitation. Okay. Hey, bud. Oh, there's two. A necklace of rudens? I wish... That you could also act. Long live the guy who pays us. Okay. Yikes. Okay. Thinks about elaborate stones. You know what? You're right and you should say it. Um. 
But the cool thing is I can spare individually. It was utterly swayed. Nice, nice, cool. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. I don't like this attack. Can we get something else? We're getting low on health. We don't have enough- we can't- <laughs> we just barely got it. Woo! Can I please? Please? Damn it. <laughs> this is so sad. Okay. That's fine. We're learning. Going forth. Hello, Triangle Man. Mama Amoeba. <laughs> Stop, Jeff. My latest cake worked me to exhaustion. So I took a little nap, but Mama Amoeba, a scary noise, woke me up. A beast was hunched on the table, eating the cake like an animal. I spritzed it with water, and it hissed and ran off. But my wonderful cake is... Aw, Chris, that sounds like Susie. <laughs> We must be going the right way. Let's try to keep her out of any more trouble. Mama Mima. The remains of the cake are still smoldering. Take a piece. The broken cake was added to your key items. Oh, okay. I, th I thought I would eat it. Hey, bud. Who are you? Kathy. Oh, I'm scared. Okay. Convince? Um... Can I convince and spare on the same turn? Oh, I can! This is beautiful! Okay. Hey. You're so right. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. It smells like a soft kiss. Okay. Extra flatter. <laughs> oh shit. Okay. You ordered Ralsei to flatter all the enemies. We don't need EXP. Just encouraging your smile is reward enough. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm gonna die. Okay. Hathi has a little secret. Okay, what's up, Hathi? We'll never know. This is scary. Can I get a healing spot soon? There are two objects hanging from the tree. Take one, yes. Thank you. Okay. Puzzle. Check the clock. In order to solve this puzzle, you'll have to hurry. I don't understand this part. Can you sit on one and I sit on another? Ooh, maybe? Okay, one more try. Fish? Sorry, I'm stupid. Ah, I got it. Cool. Okay, thank you. Oh my gosh, I was literally just about to ask for a healing place. That's crazy. Save it again, just in case. Um, and with that, we are at an hour-ish of recorded footage. So I'm going to end this episode here or now. I'm definitely really enjoying myself with this game, which is maybe not a surprise with how much that I enjoyed Undertale and its writing, but I, th I think already I enjoy this a little bit more. Is that weird to say? I'm really enjoying the art, the like step up from Undertale. Um, I'm really liking the writing. I really like my fluffy boy. <laughs> I'm really enjoying myself and I am excited to see more of this game. I hope that you are as well, but I'm gonna end this episode here. So 
Thank you for watching this episode. I hope that you enjoyed it, and I will see you next time for some more Deltarune.